What's up guys, it's Vistro here, and today we are going to be talking about um, CC card decks. Um, so, CC card decks, they are pretty efficient when it comes to, uh, like, having multiple resources and not running out of cards. And it's a lot easier to use CC card decks for some decks than it is for others, so, um, it's, it's not like, uh, CC card decks are the best thing in Yu-Gi-Oh, but they are pretty good when, um, you have a deck that constantly runs out of resources, so you need more, like uh, Light Sword or Six Samurais or Heroes. Those are three good decks that are good at 60 cards because they have multiple searchers, multiple things that can get their cards, and there are a few basics to running a 60 card deck. Um, first one is having a lot of searchers. That's that's that, that, that's a must. If you don't have a lot of searches and you're trying to run a 60 card deck, just, just don't. Um, you have to have a bit of draw power searchers. Um, you also have to have um, to stay away from the gimmicky cards. Like, uh, don't run a stupid card. Like, uh, let's say you want a 60 card 6 time right deck, right? Don't, don't let that be an excuse to use like Temple, because either way, Temple can't be used without Gateway. Really, in reality. And it's like because it can't be used without te like if the temple can't be used without the gateway, don't try to find a way to use it in a sixty card deck. Try to find try to find a way to use it in a forty card deck so it's more consistent. Like in a sixty card deck, you're gonna have to run mostly staples, like mostly cards that are like really good. You shouldn't you shouldn't use sixty cards as the excuse to run the whack cards. You should make the deck based around those cards. And it's it's really good to use 60 card deck every once in a while. You see it with like Burning Abyss, Shadows. Um, it's because those decks have a lot of searches, you know. Skarm, Tour Guide, Graph, um, Squ uh, Squatch, uh, Hedgehog, uh, you know, Shadows, Burning Abyss, they're all they're giant searches. You know, but some decks can't be run at 60 cards uh, because they don't have no searches. Like, try making a 60 card Gemini deck. Just, just try it. If if it's not complete trash, then you know what, share share it with me because I would I would like to see that. <laughs> um, but I think that's about it. You know, sixty card decks are really solid when it comes to uh, you know like keeping up the resource. You just have to make sure that you don't like there are uh, like there aren't um, ways that you would like draw into you know absolute crap because you you should be running multiple searches. At least ten of your cards should be searchers. I know that's a lot, right? No, it isn't. Um, and at least you know, like you should have a good trap set, unless you're not running traps. But why wouldn't you run traps? You have sixty cards, so you have a reason to run traps. But if you're not gonna run traps out of the way, then you know what's the point of running sixty cards? Um, and if you want to make a sixty card deck into a forty card deck. Right? If you're trying to cut down on your deck, just like cut off one of everything. You know, like cut off one of every searcher. Like, let's say you're using six hours again, because that's the one I can relate to the most. Like, instead of like, because in, in a six card six hour deck, I'll run three dojo. Like, there's no ifs, ands, or buts. But I can run more than 20 monsters, so I could keep using dojo. Right? So, um,. But 40 card deck, I would only use one dojo because, like, you you're, you have 
millions of searchers, so there's no need for multiple diligence. And you know what? That's how that's how you got to use the six hammer, um, your sixty card decks to forty, because you have to cut down on the things that you can't really like use efficiently at two or at three in a forty card deck. But that's basically it. If you enjoyed, leave a like, subscribe, anything you want. This is Nisho here, and see you on the next one. Thank you.